Hey guys, this is my 1929 Chevy Canopy Express. This is a cool little truck. This is the first six cylinder Chevy pickup truck ever made. Uh, Chevy marketed it as six for the price of four, I believe, is their slogan at the time. They were trying to compete with Ford. This truck has a brand new brake master cylinder. We just rebuilt the carburetor on it. It's got a rebuilt starter. It starts right up every single time. It runs perfect. It's not real rotted or anything like that. There's no, there's no rust on the frame or anything like that. It's got a new bed. The bed's all wood. And the truck, it, it starts right up. It runs and drives great. It shifts great. It stops great. It's a cool little truck. They used to use these for vegetables. They would fill the back of this thing with vegetables and then just park it on the side of the road and sell fruits and vegetables off of it. We had it out in front of our shop for Christmas. We had a Christmas tree in the back and we had lights all over it. And people, people thought it was great. They loved it. It has a, a newer six cylinder engine in it. It's, I believe it's a 235 inch motor, which is a late 50s, like 57 and up six cylinder, which is better than the six cylinder that it originally came with. Uh, those six cylinders had problems. This motor is absolutely great. It runs great, it starts right up. It's got a three speed manual transmission, three on the tree. It's a little dirty in the back because we had the Christmas tree in it, but. I'll show you guys underneath. It's all real solid under here. There's no rod or anything like that. Still has a spare tire. The tires have good tread on them. This is underneath the passenger side. You can see the frame rail is nice and clean. No rot, no rust or anything like that. No major leaks or anything. And you can see the new master cylinder over there under the floor. This is underneath the driver's side. Same as the other side, the frame is solid metal. It's a little dirty, but it's not rotted or anything like that. No holes in it. The muffler has a little hole in it right there, but it's not loud or anything. You see the transmission has no leaks. The oil pan's nice and dry. This would be a cool truck to paint somebody's business logo on the doors and then use it as advertisement, park it out in front of your shop, take it to car shows. That kind of thing or if you had something that you could sell out of the back of it it would be pretty cool to do that with it again because that's what it was intended for originally this is the interior it's got a little bit of storage under the seat here most of this is all wood the roof is wood the back is wood it has plexiglass door windows um i would replace them with glass they're a little bit faded i mean you can see through them just fine but they're a little bit cloudy and they rattle too when the truck's driving down the road. I would probably put some weather strips in here. The windshield opens if you, if you unscrew those those wing nuts on either side there. The windshield opens out. So in the summertime, you get fresh air. Here's the engine. It's a it's still a six volt system. Like I said, the motor runs great, and we just rebuilt the carburetor on it, so it fires right up and it idles smooth. All right, I'll start it up so you guys can hear it run. This uh, has the old style button on the floor that you have to push. So you turn the key right here to the on position and then step on the clutch, step on the button. It fires right up. This switch right here is for the heat. Like I said earlier, it's about six degrees out, something like that, six, between six and 10 degrees, I think is what the weather said. It's really cold, but it's warm inside the truck. The heat works great. Uh, this truck starts right up every single time. It runs better than half the cars at my shop. It literally fires right up. If you haven't used it in a month and you turn the key, thing step on a button, thing fires right up. It runs great. You can see it idles nice and smooth. It doesn't smoke or anything like that. There's a little bit of condensation coming out right now out of the tailpipe just because it's so cold out, but it doesn't smoke at all. It doesn't use any oil. It's a really good running motor.
down the road nice and smooth, it shifts good, the clutch works good, the brakes work good. It's a little bit rattly because the plexiglass windows on the doors, they rattle. The heat works good, it's obviously cold outside as you can tell, I think it's about 6 degrees out today. Uh, and the heat works great. <laughs> 